One of the best things about living in Norway is the beautiful surroundings, the beautiful coastlines, the beautiful fjords, the mountains. It's really a paradise. I've been passionate about water since I was a kid. I love the ocean, going fishing with my parents, swimming, snorkeling. I also have a boat so that we can uh, go for longer trips. Here at the west coast of Norway, a lot of things evolve around the ocean. It's part of our culture. I'm manager for Team Silum, participating in the Wendy Smith Ocean Health X Prize. We are participating in this competition because we want to change the way that pH is measured in the ocean. Ocean acidification is happening because we burn all this oil and we produce a lot of CO2. About 25% of this CO2 is absorbed by the ocean. The CO2 forms carbon acid in the ocean, so the pH is decreased. If the health of the world's oceans were to deteriorate significantly, this would have a massive impact on fisheries and aquaculture industries all over the world, and of course would be a catastrophe for the world's population. I work at Ondera Data Instruments, which is a part of Silam. Our main market is oceanographic. One of the main products is our current meter. We export more than 80% of all we produce. We were already working on a pH sensor. So when the X Prize competition came along, that was a perfect fit for us. We had a quite good foundation because we could utilize our opto technology, but we did not have much experience with pH measurements. The most exciting thing about this exercise is bringing together all the different research environments and really sharpening everybody's focus towards attaining pH sense technology with high stability and high precision. Uh, we were a bit nervous uh, when first putting this technology in, in the water. Well, yesterday we had an accident so we had to do some last minute repairs. It has been really great working in the exercise competition. We have really good tests and the people are great. I think the competitors really became good friends and we had quite some laughs when we arrived at, at shore again. It's very exciting to be a part of it. Team Xylum is back from the abyss! My dream for the ocean is that we are able to take care of it stop acidification and to not pollute the ocean as we do today.